Alright, um, hi YouTube land. So, obviously I'm not recording this at my desk. I'm busy in the middle of several things, as usual. But for once, I can't be sitting down taking a break. Um, so over the last week, a couple of big things for me were the posting I made about the New York City ban on significant size sugary drinks in certain locations under certain conditions. If you want to know my opinion on that, go watch it. The other thing is I have been, hi kitten, doing my best to be more routine about my workouts and being physically active because of the two major things <clears throat> that contribute to significant weight gain or weight loss activity level and nutritional intake diet uh... in my case i need to lose weight again and i've been to that end working on my activity level and i'd like to say i've been working on my diet or dieta nutrition whatever um, and I have to to a point. I've been eating better foods, but I don't know that I've been paying attention to portion control as much as I really should. And it's got me frazzled, as I'm sure you can see from my appearance right now. Um, so today, one of the things I did while I was out... Food journal. Um, typically speaking, I'm not a big fan of having to buy a book to write stuff in. Uh, although I did have journals and diaries when I was younger. But things like diet journals, I've always been kind of leery of because they don't really seem like they're worth the expense to me. But I was bargain hunting for a while and I found this one at Barnes & Noble for a reasonable price. And it's designed to last six months, which, you know, for a food journal is respectable. Um, the other thing I got, oh, grab it from under the table here, is I found this on clearance, which is good because I don't use our slow cooker nearly enough, okay? Until we got one as a wedding present from our friend Sarah and her family, I had never owned one. My dad always had one. He's a huge devotee of the crock pot. I never quite got it didn't seem totally right to me to leave food cooking when you leave the house. But now, now, now I am a crock pot convert. I admit it freely and gladly, freely and gladly. So I'm very much looking forward to that. Um, so thanks again, Sarah. Um, oh my god, I'm so tired. I have been averaging 15 to 25,000 steps a day in the last, like, two weeks. And I was building up to that point for the two weeks before that. But I haven't actually been losing any weight, which is what I was talking about, about changing your activity level and changing your diet. I know I've been active, but I haven't really lost any weight yet. I keep fluctuating within like a pound or two, which is fracking nonsense. So I figure it's got to be something nutritional. It's got to be something related to my diet. So... Try it with the food journal this time, I guess. Today, I am meeting Sam in a few hours. What time is it? Four hours? For an appointment together. Um, in this case, therapeutic. And I have no idea how that will go. I can only hope it will go well. But I have plenty to do and there's better than fair odds I'm going to stay home tomorrow because it's supposed to be disgusting out. Um, and having just recently hung, as you can see, our piece of artwork there. It's Carol King's Tapestry, one of the first albums I ever listened to as a kid. Um, I'm going to frame and hang the next one probably tomorrow. I, I don't really feel like doing it tonight. Um, but that is the new thing Sam and I have agreed on for artwork, is getting relatively inexpensive vinyl at flea markets and such, and using it as art. 
So really the expensive part there is the individual record frame uh, to hang it. But, you know, there's, there's worse ways to decorate a place. So that's it for now, I think. Um, I just got done having my healthy Subway sandwich. So I'm going to go drink some water and watch something beautifully nerdy. Star Trek, something like that. And uh, I'll talk to you guys again, hopefully with a status update about weight loss. And hopefully when I do that update, I'll have actually lost weight. Alright. Later, y'all.